Hi, so today's video is just a very basic tapping for pain recipe. Now pain is something that I always find has lots of dimensions and aspects and it is particularly helpful to work with someone or do some really serious dedicated tapping on your own to really figure it out and eradicate it from your life because it is possible. However, I also get that sometimes you don't have the time or you don't want to make that investment. So this is just a very simple formula you can use for any kind of pain at any time. As always with my videos, repeat as necessary. I try not to make them too long intentionally. The key thing here is to have a think about your pain before you get started. Figure out how strong it is on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being the strongest it's ever been for you. And to think about where it is in your body. Okay? Two very basic things. So the pain, how strong, and where in your body. And you will want to add in where you're feeling it into the sequence that I'm going to do here. So I'm just going to use back today, okay? If you have a pain in your back, great, that works for you. If it's in a specific part of your back, put that in. Replace your words and don't use mine because the more specific with tapping, the better the results, okay? And anything else, you'll see there will be moments where I will be describing the pain that I am addressing today. So you can add in your description there. If it's a throbbing pain, if it's a different kind of pain, go ahead and just talk over me. All right, here we go. Even though I have this pain in my back and it's killing me and I can't seem to concentrate on anything else, I still deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this awful pain in my back, and I don't want to do anything. I just feel like I need to lie down for the rest of the day. I choose to relax now. Even though I have this awful pain in my back. And it has me stuck because I feel like I can't do anything. And I feel irritable and anxious over this pain. <coughs> I accept this pain, and I'd like to love myself anyway. This pain in my back, this horrible pain in my back, I can't stand it. I can barely sit still long enough to do this. This throbbing pain in my back. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't think I can do something about this pain. All this pain in my back. I wonder if it is possible to get rid of it somehow. Without taking severe medication, that is. This pain in my back. This throbbing pain in my back. It makes me so anxious because I worry that it's going to be around for days. In fact, I worry I'm going to have it for a long time. This pain in my back is so strong right now. I don't feel I can function properly. All this pain in my back. I wonder if I can let some of it go. I allow myself to remember when it started exactly. What had just happened when this pain started? Or maybe something has been building up. I give myself permission to have a think about that. And to have a think about what emotion is behind this pain. Am I angry? Am I hurt? Am I disappointed? All this pain in my back 
I wonder if it's possible to let some of it go. What if my body's trying to tell me something with this pain? Maybe I need to take better care of myself. Maybe I've been overdoing it. Thank you, body. You're communicating with me and I appreciate that. And I'm not quite sure what it is you're trying to tell me. But I promise you I'm listening. I accept that you've created this pain. But I got the message. And I promise I'm looking into it. So it's not necessary to prolong it. All this pain in my back. Releasing all this tension in my back. What if I could let go of some of this pain? Relaxing every muscle in my body. What if it's possible to let go of this pain? Giving myself permission to gently think about this after I'm done tapping. Releasing some of this pain. and feeling more open and relaxed. Okay, like I said, very short, but you can keep going if you feel that it's helping. So just talking about the pain every now and then, use your reminder phrase, this pain in my back or wherever it is, and see what comes up. And again, as always, whatever comes up, please let me know and I'll be sure to make a video for you. Take care.